and welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all doing well. I've got a new video for you guys. I'm currently in the Amalfi Coast and I thought I would do a hair and makeup get ready with me. Just showing you guys some of the new products that I'm loving and how I'm using them and stuff. It's very similar to my normal get ready with me's but the view is just insane. Look. Like, yeah. I couldn't not do a get ready with me here because I absolutely love Italy so I thought it was a perfect chance to do an outdoors get ready with me. I did start indoors, you will see just how it goes. If you do like this video, don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up. This is a very, very old one, but I've had it for so long and it just doesn't run out at all. Can you stop watching me? Is it refillable? No. It's the sort of thing that you can just use whenever, it doesn't really matter. I'm going to put some eye cream on. I'm using the Olay Eyes Pro Retinol Eye Treatment. I've been using this for a very long time now. I really, really do like this product. And I'm just going to straighten my hair now. You guys have seen me a hundred times straighten my hair, so I'm just going to skip through it really, really quickly. This Cactus Crush has been amazing. It's a serum and it feels so good on my hair and it smells amazing. So just do like two pumps and just through the ends of the hair as well like that and anything left I just kind of like rub all over myself okay so I'm going to do my makeup now and I am uh, using a few new products so I'm going to go through those ones that are all new but currently going to go in straight with my hangover primer all over my face Actually, I've just decided to come outside because this is just an epic view and like you don't get views like this all the time I'm just gonna show you guys it. Yeah <gasps> that, That's what I'm working with right now. Beautiful Not a very flattering angle, but we're just gonna go with it. So I just put my primer on next I'm gonna be using the NARS radiant tinted moisturizer. It's also got SPF 30 in it, which is good I like to just put a little bit there on my hand and then dab it all over my face mm, it smells so good i can smell dinner being made downstairs I usually take my buffing brush because i like that with the tinted moisturizer i don't really like using a beauty blender with tinted moisturizer so i'm just gonna buff this in and it gives me quite a lightweight coverage which i really really like but again it is really buildable and if you use this and just massage it in with your fingers like it goes even more full coverage but it lasts all day and it just makes my skin look absolutely flawless and like i said i just want a light coverage because although we're nearing the end of the summer i'm still got a little bit of a tan and my skin feels good because of the sun and everything and i don't want it to cover everything i just want a light coverage i've had lvl lashes done so my lashes are like looking good highly recommend that treatment if you want your lashes to look good constantly but you don't like false lashes i'm going in with my becca under eye brightening corrector i've got the light to medium tone one it just brightens my eyes instantly and i just dab it in with my fingers i feel like it gives me a much more natural finish 
Another new product that I'm using is from NARS Medium One Custard Concealer. Love this. I much prefer it to the wand one. I never really enjoyed using the wand one. I felt like it was very, very drying, whereas this one is a lot creamier. So again, just dabbing it under my eye, bringing it up to the inner corner like that. Use it like a primer for my lids as well for eyeshadow. And then I also like to do it down the center of my nose because it does give it a little bit of a lightness. Can you see it already? Kind of contours it. I'm gonna set my under eyes now and I'm just using the YSL Souffle de Clet powder. It's like a pinky neutral powder. So just under the eye. Next is the fun part. I'm gonna start doing some eyeshadow. And I have got two new products that I will be using for my eyeshadow. The first is from By Terry. It's the Ombre Black Star in for the bronze moon i think this is absolutely beautiful color and it suits a lot of people as well because it's like quite a versatile color i'm just going to do the inner corners of it and it's such a creamy formula it's so nice and i'm just going to sweep it and blend it out so it hasn't got any harsh lines or anything and then the next product I'm going to go in with the NARS Singapore Quadruple Eyeshadow Palette. And I'm going to go in with that ready rusty colour. And I'm just going to do the corners, like the crease in here. Blend it up and just give it like a really nice smoky effect. I really, really like this. Nice. And then I'm going to go in and do my inner corners. Going in with that champagne colour. Sorry, pigmented. It's unreal. And then I'm going to go back in with the By Terry. And then I'm going to blend it out again with the same fluffy brush. I think I want to go in with that dark glittery brown. And I'm just going to put that in between the two. Literally just one little sweep over both. And then I'm going to go in a little bit more red, I think. Mm, yeah, I really like that. Perfect. Okay, so the eyes are done. I'm going to do my eyebrows, contour, mascara. So for my eyebrows, I am using the YSL Couture Brow in the shade 1. And where I've had my eyebrows microbladed, I don't really need to do much to them. So I just like to brush them out. It's very similar to the Gimme Brow by Benefit, actually really really like it it gives a little bit of color and it just keeps them all in place and i just brush these ones up and these all to the side like that brows are done next i'm gonna go straight into contour and for contour i've been loving using the hula contour stick i think it's incredible for the summer and i just literally do so many lines across my face up my nose like that and then I come around like that and it just gives a very soft contour that you can blend out easily and I never used to like cream contours until I purchased this and this is more like a creamy powder contour I'd say I blend it all out down my nose again from Becca it is beach tint in guava like that that's a bit too much. It's a cream blusher. Again, never was a fan of them until I found this one. And I just dab a little bit on my finger and then do it on the apples of my cheeks. And then I blend it out with a different finger like that. And it just gives a really nice pinky cheek, rosy cheek look. Yeah, I'm really happy with that glow. I'm going to set it all and then go in with powder on top. It's so noisy. I hope you guys can hear everything. Setting again with the same powder. Set it on. Set my nose. Set your top lip as well. Now I'm going to go in with another new product. It's NARS Laguna Bronzer. Absolutely love this bronzer. And I go in with an angled contour brush and just... Again, the same places that I kind of contoured, just warm them up a little bit more. And I mean, you don't actually need to do this, but I just like to be really, really bronzed. 
and that's that next i'm going to highlight with i think you've seen this before fenty beauty killer watt in the watch color am i using i use the fire crystal really nice champagne pinky color and it's so vibrant like look at this yeah that's what i thought top of my lip down the bridge of my nose up here just like that go in with a little bit more blusher and it's again from nars it's the nars orgasm and it's in this large one which i think is insane this time just slightly here here there we go and the last thing left now is for me to do my mascara i'm going to be using the all slash telescopic from l'oreal which is like one of my favorite mascaras of all time and because of the lvl my lashes just look insane like look at that and then a little bit on the lower lashes as well and then i'm just going to lip liner it with the nars morocco lip liner one of my current favorites because it's quite a neutral color you can use loads of different nudes with it Top, I'm gonna be putting this lip lacquer lip guide from NARS in the colour Xeon and I think it just ties the whole look together and that is my get ready with me finished so hair and makeup is all done now I've just got to put on an outfit I hope you guys have enjoyed this video if you have don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up I will see you guys in my next video bye Oh, 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 oh,